events like this have, have totally changed Plymouth, without a doubt. You know, he's bought a town that is in a bit of a sleepy backwater. We're at the bottom end of the country, without a doubt. Um, and it's bringing, you know, huge international artists here. And, you know, the bus is incredible. We, we've got something to be really proud of. And I mean, this at the end of the day, how many festivals, you know, do you have a view like that? It's incredible. The buzz in town, the shops and all the clubs and all the bars and everybody's benefiting from it. It's cool. If you just look around you, this, this setting is absolutely beautiful. It's breathtaking, man. I mean, like, it's so beautiful, man. Look at that lion over there. You know when you get those puzzles with all the pieces and you put it together? It's like it's this picture that you put together, you know? It's like a perception that MTV isn't a serious music channel. I think that's why they changed the name from music television to MTV because it is essentially reality TV. Um, I personally like always loved MTV because I remember the beginning of satellite TV and it was awesome at the time. You know, I remember I used to watch music videos all night, I'd stay up late, my parents would get really mad. And I think one of the great things about a party like this is it shows that, you know, MTV wants to get involved at a grassroots level in real music. And you guys are coming back and bringing in bringing in music this way. This is the real way. This is actually what I think of festivals. Festivals is a new radio. It's good to see MTV doing something like, you know, credible and something real with music. When it comes to it, I had no idea that it would come to this, but it's amazing, I, I, I love it. I, I wouldn't do anything else. I love having the opportunity to go out and, and play the music that I'm making and get that instant feedback. It's honestly like one of the best feelings in the world, man. You can't compare to that. What you wanna do, baby? Where you wanna go? I'll take you to the moon, baby. I'll take you to the floor. i treat you like a real lady, no matter where you go. Just give me some time, baby, cause you know, baby. Funny. 
um, a lot of people always ask me, you know, how, how, do, how do you become successful with music? How do you, you know, how do you start to make money and stuff like that? You know, how do you, how do you get your, your paycheck at the end of the day? But, you know, at the end of the, at the end of my days, back in the day when, you know, when I had my, my first child and um, I had three jobs, to me, music was the reward. You know, it was the paycheck at the end of the day. So, I didn't expect anything from it. So, to be here, it's kind of like, I feel like this, this success that I've been given, it's like, I feel like more free to share it. I'm glad I don't like, oh, this is mine, you know, like, I'm glad I didn't let it get to that point. England is uh, one of those countries for me that I'm, I'm not sure if they know my songs. So, um, when you see these kids that are singing along to your songs and they're not played on the radio, and that actually makes it even more special to me. It's the most awesome thing to play to a big crowd of people. Just that feeling of like, you know, togetherness and all these faces that you don't know. I like to think of like, you know, people that we play to as being friends that we haven't met yet. And like when we're on stage and we're jumping around with everybody else, it feels like you're part of a family. It's the most amazing thing. All hands on the trigger. All eyes on the gun They don't believe that we're Strong enough to hold on Cause I'm the only one to get you The only one to figure you out You're a place that I can go to A face I couldn't live without And nobody sees what we do Events like this that you guys put on are, it's the soul of what we do. You know, like this music is made to be played really loud and to lots of people.
come down here more often. 